I'm happy to be joined here today with Nicole Terrio with Border Paws. Thank you so much for joining me today. Uh, it's not Pet Project, but we are talking about uh, a sale that you have going on. Yeah. So we have um, we have our all of our adoptable adult animals, so dog and cat, are fifty percent off. We have a huge number in dogs that we actually have no space to intake anymore. We're filled right up, starting to get a lot of random single puppies like this little girl here, Tonka. So yeah, we just kind of need to clear out the shelter. Um, so we are doing a 50% off all adult animals. So that's any animals six months and older. And how many dogs and cats would you say that you have currently, if it, even if it's a rough estimate on how many you actually do have in the shelter? Yeah, so we have, I know for a fact, we have 24 dogs in our care right now. So that's quite a bit. Um, a few are in foster, though. A few of the puppies are in foster. And then cats, I would say we probably have about 30 to 40 cats as well. And especially with uh, stray season kind of starting up with the summer and all of that, you really want to make sure that you have the space to intake all of them, even if it is going to a foster home. Uh, for, for that situation, if people do find strays, what should they do? I know we've talked about it before, but it's a good reminder to have for people. So yeah, like uh, if you get a stray, obviously if it's injured, um, they take priority. Uh, I would recommend calling the vet clinic and getting them there. We work really close with Animal Hospital as well as Weirs. So then they'll contact us and get the animal medical care. I know with the heat too, you might see a lot of animals in distress, you know, just with it being so hot out. But um, yeah, no, or you can give a shelter call, or if you see a dog running around, or even a cat, you can always give the Lloyd Minster bylaw call, and then they can actually come and get, because you always want to be careful when you're going up to a dog, right, or a cat, because you never know if they're going to bite you or not, and if they have disease, then it could lead to all kinds of problems. So I recommend just calling the Lloyd Minster bylaw office, and then they'll get in touch with us, and we can get the animal in there. <laughs> seems like Not a crazy a dog talking. for sure um now I know what we were talking earlier before we started about the importance of spay and neutering your dogs and your cats tell me a little bit about why that is important and why people should continue to do so so yeah it's pretty much the main reason why animals are going to roam um unneutered males they're looking for a mate in cats and dogs so if your male is unneutered they're going to be going out and trying to leave your house to go find a female that they can mate with so we can actually reduce the or strays by just spaying and neutering it's so important because they get out and end up with unwanted litters and then, you know, that's why all the shelters are full is I know it's an accidental litter, but I mean, that extra 10 puppies trying to find them homes and stuff like that makes quite a big difference in what we can intake. So my recommendation for anybody who has their animals or roaming, get them spayed and neutered because it will definitely help to keep them wanting to stay on their property and not be roaming looking for a mate. And for this 50% off sale, how long is it going to till and um, how can and is the application process the same as always? So yeah, we were only going to do it till this Saturday, but we've actually decided to extend it till May 27. So you still have all this week and next week. And yeah, the application would be the same. You would just <laughs> she likes to chew. <laughs> um, you would just send in your application and then one of our representatives will contact you and we can either set up a meet and greet or if you've already had your main, mind made up, you can come down uh, and we'll get the adoption going for you. And like, so it's 50% off. So I believe that's going to work for adult cats. You get adult cats for $75 and then they're regular 150 and then adult dogs are 250 but you'll get those at half price too. So 125 and the animal comes Mike up to date on vaccines, microchip, as well as spayed and neutered. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for joining me again. And uh, hopefully the sale gets some of these animals into their forever home. So you have more space and they're, in, they're also in a loving home as well. So thank you. Thank you.